What's up, Time Keepers? Me, Tom Game here, bringing you Red Dead Redemption 2. Surf Radio, I'm ready to time to roll the intro. Alright, guys, so finally we're bringing you Red Dead Redemption 2. This game I've been waiting so long. It's unfortunate it comes out at the same time as uh, Fallout 76, but I will be playing this game a lot. I was actually quite surprised. Uh, like, I, I've been following the game in and out for a bit. But it's actually funny because when I got the PS4 version, uh, the the hard copy, and uh, on in in inside the case there's actually the map, and then the first part of the map is new is new uh, new Austin, basically the first game itself, and then you're like okay, and I knew the map was bigger than that, but then you turn the map around, and the game's actually like six times bigger than new Austin. You say oh new the the the, the part you played in red uh, RDR the first one is there all of it. And then you have this entirely new fucking map. Like, literally, this... I don't know if you're going to see it properly. This is basically Red Dead Redemption 1, which is in this game, in Red Dead Redemption 2. And then after that... This is the the the, the, the whole map after that. And I'm going to try to... And New Austin is right... Uh, where is it? It's on the other side. It's right here. Like, right here is New Austin. Like, it keeps going. It keeps going. It, it, it keeps going this way. <laughs> so, this map is going to be huge to play with. I can't wait to try it. Sorry, I've been going on so far. Hopefully, you guys in, are enjoying the sweet overlays I did, if you wonder why. Because I'm playing over on Twitch.tv for slash me time game, where I'm probably going to be streaming a lot of this game. So, you're going to see, basically, highlights, uh, story, and all that stuff. I'll try to turn off the... I'll try to turn off all the... Um, all the things while I'm playing, so... By 1899, the Age of Outlaws and Gunslinger was at its end. America was becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roam, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Ooh man, this is putting the vibe on. Rockstar Game presents. Red Dead Redemption 2. It's funny, the, the, the Red Dead Redemption music always sounds like spooky a bit for some reason. <laughs> I'll try not to talk during the story parts. says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! That's a nice little caravan you got there. Chapter 1, Coulter. Red 
Bring him in here. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Come All right, we're back. Let's go. Ain't right. sure what we're going to find out here, Dutch. All right. We have to try. Stay close, and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more. It feels like weird <laughs> playing oh, Red Dead in the winter. <laughs> Where are you going, Dutch? Tap. Can I ride faster in the snow? All right. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Slow. Okay. Okay. Well, not stop. I know, horsey. Whatever your name is. Hey, move up alongside me. Can't see you back there. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to I'm get trying my best. those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. And what about the money? 
Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It stashed with the rest of the money in town. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Whoa! All right. Sorry to tip. Who's there? Don't make me shoot you in the dark. Gentlemen, found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. Let's go. I'm glad you're alright, Micah. <laughs> Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. <laughs> well, he does. He has to do Red Dead, the first one. still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Ah, shut. Kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp, back up the hill, huddled around a fire, waiting for Daddy to put food on the table. Huh? Waiting for Daddy to put food on the table. I've said it before. We got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few Unfortunately, we do. Now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. All okay. right. Let's head down there. You said put away the lanterns. Why didn't you put your lantern away? What the heck, man? All right. Sorry to star my my uh, overlays hiding the 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 subtitles a bit. Let's hitch up here. So far, so good. Let oh, me handle this. we don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like a hoot nanny. Ooh, thick one. Following Sounds you, Dutch. Like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. Yeah. All right, I was going the right way. Right here. All right, one take cover. All right, we got this. Hello. Shut up, really. Excuse me. <laughs> What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the train. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body in the I, I got it. I hear you. Just 
Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, but... Oh, the Colts coming up. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Shit, look out, there's more to Was I supposed to short a shoot first? Yeehaw! I mean, Jesus Christ, there's a lot of people in here. All right. Sweet old daddy gun. A good shooting we got there. I'm gonna I'm gonna start talking like this while I'm playing, I guess. <laughs> oh. I said I'd handle this. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Driscoll boys here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. All right, time for some warmth. More warmth. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials: food, medicine, whiskey. All right. Uh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Open satchel. Okay, this is a hold kind of button going on. Mmm, mm-mm. Canned sweet corn. O'Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. Blood. Got some fighting Big going on there. Blood on the floor here. I saw. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Fucking <laughs> Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Oh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. All right, all right, Dutch. I'm gonna keep picking up some food then if there is any. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm going to start packing the horses. Alright. There's a second story here. here when you're done. Oh, did the door open? Oh, okay, it does open. Oh, it goes outside. No, there's a second story I have to go look at. Class it out. Ooh. Yes, thank you. What in the goddamn... Alright. Back down we go, and out we go. I have to remember X is running. Jewelry is good for money. Premium cigarettes. Probably one of the guys smokes or girls. Inspect card. From an American card, 12 from an American illusion of President Alfred McAllister. Jolly Joel, okay. That's cool. I guess collectibles in the game? When you pick up some... I have to stop crouching. Oh. All 
All right, I guess that's gonna be it. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. What? Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. All right, let's go to the barn then. Open barn door. Some horses in there. Got a fist fight. What's going on? This <laughs> guy just jumped me. Oh, oh, did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Calm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. <gasps> Where's Colm O'Driscoll? <laughs> With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Alright. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Do I just keep beating the shit out of him? There you go. Okay, he's, he's done. Oh, pick up gun, eh? Alright. Ooh, Kettleman Revolver. Goddamn right, I need my hat. So far, so good. I forgot to do something, that's why. I... There you go, that's much better. Now I can see it. The horse has now become your horse, as indicated by the on, on the radar. Is that bastard still in there? He's dealt with. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. You're goddamn right. He's already skittish. Where do I hitch? Right here? Hitch horse. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Fuck, she come out of. Okay. We mean you no harm. Miss. Miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. God damn. Oh. Nice going, Micah. What a dumb, okay, dumb, dumb. dumb. They came three days ago. And Bob has been me. Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're bad you men, know, but we're not them. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's nice going, name, Mika. Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Is 
those sons of bitches. and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently, scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up, give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch <laughs> of darkies? Get yourself oh, to bed. Jesus Christ. That storm just keeps it coming. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. <gasps> Hello, Arthur. Uh, Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. <laughs> he ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank is that, you is that Javier Esquela? I don't remember this way last I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave not like that no, it wouldn't be the first time <laughs> I feel like John in this one, John Marston, feels like uh, the underdog in the story, sort of uh, like the the weak pushover kind of guy in the story. He, he didn't feel that way. He seemed like he was in the first Red Dead. He was that rugged, like I've seen some shit type of guy. But in this, he's portrayed as like just like the bottom of the barrel henchman or something. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Ah, we'll just kill. Well, seems somebody left recently, and that way. Sure. Well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river, and this Basio. Go, Javier. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Holy shit, I don't want to fall there. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What, Reed? Oh, what happened? Okay. Uh, John has returned from an early scout. Okay, I think I pressed something uh, back. Okay. Okay, no, I'm good. Let's go. On that boat. We had the money. It seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. 
Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl. Oh, okay. First person. Bad Keep forgetting way. that's a thing. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> oh, he's looking over. That's cool. Davey got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business. Ooh, all right. cinematic camera. Idiots. Okay. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Well, move then. Andale. Is it time to activate the, the Skyrim horse? Or we just fucking go up the mountain straight up? We'll be going down to my, up the mountain when she comes. Watch yourself, it's not very wide here. Yeah, well, you go first. Yeah, well, you go first. Come on, boy. Horse struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Now let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Oh, it stops. It stopped snowstorming here. Almost there. Come on now. Do horse actually fare well in the winter? Like in hard snow like that? I really don't know. Oh. A horse. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Yeah. I wonder if it's the same actor that plays John this time around. from your horse who knows what's up ahead all right all right I'm going back to my horse horse weapons oh mama down this way that's a cool mutter light right there This. Over here. It's coming from this way. Okay. How the fuck are we gonna Watch get back up here? here? Yeah, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. Where the hell is he? Come on, Johnny boy, we got you. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Careful here. We gotta walk all the way back here after Watch with a fucking here. half frozen person. Okay from here. Watch your step. This is real simple. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Closer now. Come on. I might need a couple of foods here. We're coming, John. It's 
square. Square is the right button. I'm a coming, I'm a coming. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John! Marston, you hear me? John, where are you? John, can you hear me? John! Over here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! God damn it, John. Scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> John, what happened? You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. I wonder is 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 uh is Arthur Morgan ever mentioned? Can't go back the way we came. Is Arthur Morgan ever ever mentioned uh, in the first Red Dead? Can't argue with you there. I don't remember his name ever being mentioned. Damn it. <laughs> you see that on the ridge? Arf. I'll distract him while you get to the horse. Go. Draw them off. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. I can't skin him. Goddamn wolfy no skins. Yeah, you guys are, f are fucking cold, right? Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Gonna be okay to her, John? Poor John. I don't remember parking here. Come on then. Let's get back to the others. Yeah. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. <sighs> Knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Oh, come on. Aren't you supposed to turn at the same time? Up there! More of them! God damn it. I just hit him with the horse. You see any more, Arthur? Don't think so. Jesus. It's like you the Crips in GTA, but wolves instead. Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. 
None of us are lucky right now. All right, let's get to the cabin. She'll ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, <laughs> freezing, bleeding, starving. Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, All right, let's go. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. All right, let's go, let's go. Yeah, our wagons are done. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Uh oh. Uh oh. Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. Okay, I was like, oh shit, no one's coming out. <laughs> here we go. There we go. Ay, careful, idiotas, it's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks, I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That's civilization. I know. The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Mogi. All right, all right. 